Hello beautiful and wonderful people. Welcome back to Jinamon channel. If you are new here, it's so great to have you. Please don't forget to follow my page and subscribe to my channel as well. In today's video, I'll share with you how to make this amazing, delicious, simple and easy fried tilapia. This turned out so, so delicious. It's a new method and I hope you're going to like it. I paired this with achike. It's so so yummy shows, guys. Try this and let me know. Let's get started. So this are the tilapias that I'll be using and as you can tell from the video, I've washed it and then make sure the gods everything is taken and it's clean so i went ahead and made make some scores like some cuts the like one two three cuts on it you want the spice to penetrate well so make this procedure and trust me once it's done you will love it in the separate bowl i added in fish seasoning ginger powder garlic powder onion powder chili powder and salt. I'll mix this together to well combined and spread some on top of the tilapia. So this recipe is very simple and easy. I'll list the exact amount of the ingredients that I used in the comment section or in the description box below. When done, make sure you rub it all over. When done, flip it and repeat the same process. So it should be something like this when you are done. Make sure the spice is gone everywhere. That's what you're looking for. I'll then cover it with a clean napkin or you can even use a clean film and then let it marinate for at least two hours. After two hours, I'll go ahead and blend ginger, garlic, onion, red bell pepper, green bell pepper, and habanero pepper. I'll blend this until almost smooth. I didn't blend it that smooth thing. So I'll go ahead and preheat my oil as well. I added in um, rosemary and sage leaf. I'll then go ahead and fry the tilapia. Bear in mind, I marinate mine for about two hours, but you can go more or do less. 30 minutes to one hour should be fine i'll go ahead and fry like 10 minutes or 10 to 12 minutes on both sides and then after 12 minutes i'll flip it and then let the other side um, fry as well so guys just look at this this is beautiful and when you are frying tilapia make sure you have time for the tilapia if not it could tear or it wouldn't come out as you're looking for so just have time for it and then when flipping be careful <laughs> give it time and then be careful just look at it isn't it beautiful guys it's amazing this is so, so delicious so once it's done frying I'll take it off from the fire and just look at this isn't it beautiful isn't it beautiful guys <laughs> Just look at it. So I'll take it off from the fire and then in the same saucepan, I'll add in just a little bit of olive oil and then the blended um, veggies. I'll rinse the blender and add in a little bit of water to help cook the veggies. So you want to cook this until oil began to form um, on top. As you can tell, the, the veggies, I didn't blend it too smooth. Like just, it's like... I just pause it for like two three times and that was fine so that is it I let this cook for about 10 minutes or 10 to 15 minutes and look at this and as you can tell from the video it's getting ready here I'll go ahead and add in um, chopped green pepper red pepper red onion and white onion so if you want you can blend them together this part is not necessary but i prefer adding it to like making it because i still want some chunks of veggies in the sauce i added in chicken seasoning dry shrimp powder and then salt but if you don't have the dried shrimp powder you can use um shrimp cube and that's fine so once it's ready i let it cook for like two minutes more then i place the tilapia on top of the sauce guys this is amazing trust me it's delicious it's yummy name it <laughs> name it guys just scoop some of the sauce on top and then let it cook for like for like three minutes more and you do not want to overcook the veggies that you added to it so when you get to this point flip it and let it cook like three minutes more and that's a straight nice mama mia you need to try this recipe guys you need to try this recipe 
So let it cook for like two minutes more, like I said, and it's ready. I paired this with a chicken. You can eat it with a ba, bangkun, kinky, any swallow food be awake. <laughs> and look at this, guys. Wow. 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 It's so, so delicious. And it's amazing. It's yummy. Shows. Serve this to your guests. And trust me, you come to write in my comment section that thank you, Gina. <laughs> <laughs> just look at it i hope you really enjoyed watching this video why don't you give me a credit by giving this video a thumbs up share comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already follow my page and guys see you in my next video till then <laughs> love you all and stay blessed It's delicious. Adios. Bye-bye.